start the podcast? No. Yes, we. It's been going on. But we, but did we ever started. say well? Oh fuck! No, no you we were didn't. crying. Yeah, you've done crying. Well, I'm sorry. I'm drinking. Hey, what the fuck's going on, everybody? This is the official Trailer Prep Boys podcast coming at you this episode. It's <laughs> 15 and it's April 6th. Done. Yeah, we're about 15 minutes in. That's all right. Time to say the. Ricky, what are you doing? Speaking of goals. What are you doing? We weren't speaking of goals, were we? Golden eggs. Golden eggs, okay. It was a while ago. Um, there was a fucking plane that took off from Russia and uh, $375 million worth of gold fell out of the RS Endeavor. No way. Yeah. Fucking problem with the door. Jesus, Murphy. Three tons. Three tons of gold. What? You think the dummies work at the airport, but why would you report it? It's take it. See ya. Well, oh. I bet you listen. Bet you right now Putin had something to do with it. He's like, oh, just leave that hatch. Unlocked. Out she goes. Putin goes and gets it now. He's got a new car. He is, yeah, he is the richest man in the world. Is he? He steals, doesn't he? Putin, I would not want to fuck with that guy. He's I think he's got the craziest KGB, man. man. Craziest man in the world. Guy. Ex KGB. And Donald Trump acts like, oh, yeah, I, Putin can't outsmart me. I'm as smart as he is. Putin could outsmart him and with the fucking brain. I like, I like him. the guy. Who? Putin. No, Ricky, he murders people. Oh, okay, I didn't know about that. Well, I like him other than that. Yeah, I just, I mean, I bet you something to do with that gold. I bet you that gold's in his fucking garage right now. Yeah, about 120 million bucks. Yeah, he's got her in his garage. 20? That's probably, I bet you if you research it when he goes to the... million fucking dollars. I bet you if you research it when he goes to the shop to get a drink, he just throws down a little gold nugget. Bet you a thousand bucks. I would not fuck with that guy. No. No, sorry, Bob. Can he scrap or what? Putin, I bet you can fucking tangle. He's in good shape. I bet you can tangle. He's got a nice body. <laughs> He's got a nice body. <laughs> what? <laughs> what <do you> know? <laughs> I, he puts pictures out of himself fishing, and he's got a nice physique. I don't mean in a sexual way. I just mean he's got a nice it body. It sounds kind of like that way. And I bet you it makes Donald Trump crazy, because Donald Trump couldn't put out pictures of himself. With his shirt off, fishing. I wish he would. Oh, I wish he would, too. Putin's all jacked. Sounds like you really, really like this guy. Oh, as if you've never seen pictures of Putin with no shirt on. Google it. I thought his name was Vladimir Putin when I first heard about him. Poopin. How does that make you feel, Bubs? There he is. Look, I mean... Oh, he's in good shape. Any moving parts right now for you? No, I no. just mean the man's in good shape. Let's I don't mean one. I'm sexually attracted to him. He's Russian, first of all. I wish we lived in Taiwan. Why? Because something cool happened there. They had a nine-hour rainbow. Imagine just being baked, baked as fuck for nine hours. How does that make you feel? Butterflies? That's just proving my Anything? point. The man's got a nice... Body <laughs> shape. He's got a nice body. He's got a nice body. Doesn't mean I want to do things to him. <laughs> he's fishing. He's fat. He's got a nice body. I wish I had a body like him. You can. I mean, he doesn't fucking. I guarantee you, he doesn't eat fucking fourteen fucking pounds of McDonald's food every day, like you know who. Randy. Okay, bus. How does that make you feel? Okay, we got to stop looking Obama at Obama and Putin. Obama's got a beautiful body, too. <laughs> well, I would think you'd say something like that. Obama's got a nice, nice body. <laughs> I don't mean it in a weird okay. way. I'm just saying. Okay, it's on a... I could have a body like okay, President one, one Obama. To ten. One to ten. Ten being hot, okay? No, not hot. <laughs> Putin. One to ten. Just, you know, you know what I mean. Putin, I... I think he's an eight. Okay. Obama. <laughs> Obama, he's a, he's an eight and a half. Eight nine, and a half. Right there. All right. Good looking fella. Okay, bubs. But I'm not, don't 
twist this into I want to bang one of them. this shirtless man? <laughs> but, uh, I twist this into the fact that anything weird, I'm just judging them on pure oh, looks. Oh, man, you're really going to... You're really going to like this one. That's him and the horse. Shirtless. He looks great on a horse. <laughs> he looks great. <laughs> he looks great on a horse. If we're just talking pure physicality, I wish I could ride around on a horse looking like that. Okay, if you could ride around on a horse with no shirt with this guy, would you do it? Not with him, no. Like, like barebacking? Well, barebacking who? The horse or <laughs> Putin? Do you mean doubling? Like holding, well, yeah, holding you, around well, the waist? Whatever. What do you use your imagination and you just come up with any whole scenario? No, but I would not ride right. around on a horse with Putin. Bareback man. The Russian the broke down. What was it? Broke back man. Yeah, that was it. No, I'm not sexually attracted to Vladimir Putin. Let's make that clear. Right so now. just Obama? No, not Obama. I just think they both have nice bodies. Oh, they get like. A Putin shirtless challenge. So there's actually people throwing photos and saying, hey, that guy, put me up against Putin. Yeah, what do you think guy, I am? I don't like him. You don't <laughs> like his body? No, he's too big, too muscular, too hairy. You yeah. like, like the cuddly kind of feeling. Like you don't want to <laughs> grab onto some soft shit, right? Yeah, I don't know That's what you're doing. Muscly stuff. I'm All comfortable right, in my sexuality, just so everybody's aware. <clears throat> Okay. Now, if you want to dig up some pictures of Patrick Swayze and see... Uh, yeah, I was waiting for that. No, I, that's why I'm good. Pull up a picture of Swayze with no shirt on. See oh, if you get okay. a boner. I bet a thousand dollars. Come on, bubs. You got a thousand dollars. You know what? I didn't say anything like that to you. you bring out the old boner. You're saying you used to pull up the picture oh. of him when he danced with Chris Farley on Oh, I did. When he was the chip and That was a you funny know, skit. And you but... used to say, oh, my fuck, I... Like, take a piece of that. Like, to take a piece of that. <laughs> <laughs>